team would go to this stage because they're Sheik Falcon and that against a Fox. Oh, Fox. Oh, oh. oh. I thought Paul Chen was a Falcon. No, he uh, he's a Fox. Oh, well then. Then right. this isn't a bad pick. All right, looks like uh, we have a one-on-one -on -one Fox. Red Fox is, was zoning out that Falcon pretty well. Yeah, it looks like... Uh, is that a Gim? Oh, oh, I think Spark threw that away. He just needed to grab the ledge, and he would have yeah. had that Gim. But uh, that Falcon did, did a pretty good job making it ambiguous. Whether yeah, or not he was. and that's clearing both of their stocks. Oh. That was really quick. That was a clean yeah. first stock. It was Falcon up their knee, and I believe the Fox just uh, wave shined up smash. A good up smash out of shield from Paul Chen. Uh, up airs. That was good on Falcon's part. He noticed his teammate missed the up air and he, uh, he covered it. They missed the uh, chance for team combos there and getting punished for it. Uh, so the Fox went for the normal ledge guard and she green normal getup and uh, Red Fox just knew. I believe, yeah, Red is Paul Chen yes. back here. Paul Chen getting uh, hit by that YOLO knee. Yeah, Falcon's oh. pretty strong in doubles uh, in terms of team combos. Yeah, Just he's such a need. great stock tank, and he lives forever. Yeah, man, that's oh. good. Wow, we got a taunt coming out from. <laughs> is that Mass Heist? Mass Fox? Heist. Yeah. Yeah. Is uh, he is he known for being a BM? Um, right <laughs> no, but you know we're in the Bay. We have to like you know represent ourselves because if we don't do something memorable, no one no one remembers Sacramento. There's a lot of pride on the line here for Sack. Well, they are definitely making a statement right now. Five stocks to two. Yeah. And percentages are fairly even. Oh, are we getting a gimp? Ooh, Ooh that, that was a double nice gimp. But uh, Falcon is Ooh. living. That was a great save by Mass Heist. That was good, just that down air. And Spark getting reversed edge guarded. All right. I mean, it's still possible. This is Fox in a 1v2. This is the best 1v2 character in the game, but uh, it's looking... Oh, misspacing that side. Looking grim. Is this best of five, do you know? I believe it is best of five. Okay. So that was that was a pretty, uh, pretty strong showing. Yeah, let's uh, see if Paul Chan and Spark could do something about it. How they respond. Uh, I, I believe part of the problem there might have been the stage. Spark got wave shine up smashed a couple stocks, I think at least two. Mm -hmm. And uh, well, as a Sheik, I, I just don't like FD against Foxes. It's scary. Yeah, as a Puff, I actually don't like FD myself. Because uh, turns out that my my partner needs platforms to get out. And FD doesn't allow that. Yeah. <laughs> that platform game's really important in doubles. The layout of the platforms, the height of them are especially important. The difference between Yoshi's in Dreamland, they look the same, but on a different scale, but their world's different in doubles. Yes. I do like this counter pick. Uh, it looked like Red Team was not doing as well as Mass Heist and the Notorious in close quarter combat. So I actually do like this pick a lot. Ooh, going for he didn't get punished for that, so it's fine, I guess. I actually missed how Paul Chen died. Uh, I, I also missed that. Uh, that was a good uh, needle by Spark to stop the team combo. He uh, needled right as Fox was going to do probably an air back air. Wave shining through the stage. Oh, that was a... I'm sure that was a misinput. I'm sure he wanted to drop the platform for me. Uh, yeah, he... Uh, all of the... Uh, or both of these players are really proficient at shield dropping, so it was probably a shield drop knee. Surprise that uh, hit so far. We're looking pretty even. A little more percent on uh, red team, but I mean, that can go away in an instant. And are we gonna edge guard the fox? Oh, he went for an up tilt. I think a down smash would have covered probably both the options. I don't know. Oh, good job. Ooh, shine bear. That's incredibly hard with fox. Shine bear? Yeah, shine yeah. bear uh, off of an up throw. Looks like uh, they are forcing 1v1s. They forced 1v1s um, in that last 20 seconds over there. But the green team recognized it and started uh, playing teams. Fair and um, Yeah, I think, I think Spark probably wants a 1v1 because I think Spark would 
would win against either of these players in a 1v1, but I don't know about Paul Chen. You know, you have to have both. If you're going to do the 1v1 strat, you both have to be stronger players than your opponents. And Paul Chen is quite... Um, he, he, he is, is a good... He, he is, is a good player, but even if it evens out, it, it's hard to deal with. Much closer game from much closer game from uh, game one. Yeah, the uh, the platform Spark has been doing a lot of needles and interrupts from the platform, so that was that was a good pick to go to this stage or to give uh, tri platforms to to Spark. I think. Me. Yep. Let's see if they can edge guard this. Oh no! Nope. Oh uh, no! He, he was, went back. Yeah, he was uh, conflicted what to do. No, I think he made the right choice. Yeah. That was good. And one more time. Oh, that was oh, actually team bad. Kill. Oh was, no! No, he's getting back. Let's see if Falcon Spark gets back. rolling a lot. He uh, oh. seems to have trouble. Like stay. He seems to get being get caught in shield a lot. Ooh, Great. that was a good up B. Saving the teammate, and it was good on uh, Sheik's part to go into it. Nice. Ooh. Oh, but sacrificing himself for it. Yeah. All right. All right so three stocks to one, this but the is Fox could die from four there. This is very possible for Spark to win. Oh, no. oh, neat. Oh, oh no. I think Spark should try to get them to play Neat closer to the ledge. Yeah, yeah. He really <laughs> needs Gimps right now. He's not going to out-trade them or anything at this percent. Yeah. Uh, and this is an easy edge guard. I'm surprised that um, Falcon didn't grab the ledge, honestly, oh. but it works out. Because I think, uh, you know, Falcon grabs the ledge, Fox up smashes, or forward smashes. It's much yeah. stronger. Uh, I guess Falcon's mm. confident in getting an E2. So. Didn't really make a difference. Yeah, still got the kill. Still two up, 2-0. Two oh. Let's see. Are they gonna... That was... I wouldn't expect them... Oh, okay. They actually decided to change stages. I was gonna say that I wouldn't be surprised if they decided to go back. They didn't do a bad job, though. Yeah. Huh? Uh, I, I think... I think this stage is better for Fox and Mass Heist is putting in more work than Paul Chen, I think. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know about this pick. Oh no, that was great um, defense from... Uh, that was really good, almost saving uh, his teammate. Oh! Weak reverse Falcon up air into the Fox's up air. That was really good. Wow, Falcon barely dying off the top from that up smash. Interesting back throw from uh, Falcon. Oh, oh that was so good. Guard. So good by the Falcon to he was uh he was beating up Spark and he got the down throw instead of tactician he went and helped his teammate. That's that's a solid team's play right there. And then he up throws his teammate right after. <laughs> So it's looking in Green's favor so far. For sure. Um, it's still fairly even. Everyone's at high percent. That's five true. stock. No, no, actually, they're two stocks ahead. I'm, mis yeah, I'm they mistaken. Are. They, they are so high they percent, though. All right. Ooh, evening up the stock air. count. By Paul Chen. Spark being the one at high percent, I believe, is okay. Oh. Because Cheek is quite elusive on the ledge. So he'd be able to stall out and stop tank quite a bit. Oh, Spark went really far into the stage. Didn't get that knee to edge guard. Ooh, good shine, wave dash, up smash from Mass Heist. Secure the kill. Are we gonna get an edge guard from Spark? Oh, good. Oh, that was. Oh, edge oh, guard, God. down smash. Oh, that was a good tech by uh, Mass Heist. Ooh. Was that up throw, up smash? Did the fox just not jump? I didn't catch that. I'm not exactly sure what happened. It could have been up tilt. Either way, it was a good up smash to finish the stock. Oh, green stage. Ooh. Off wow. stage. Look at they turned that around so, so quick. So quick. quick. Uh, now it's even. Uh, it's completely it's even. even. Oh. Are they, can they kill them in the, the time? No. Oh, no. I think uh, in that situation, the fox should have just held the grab let the falcon need, and that would have gotten more damage than just the throw guy. Ooh. Red team being sandwiched in between the green team right now. Oh, and red team got out. Good, good down kill. smash from Spark. Uh, and this should be a 
Easy, easy as nope. cart. Nope. Red team both shielding. Playing pretty scared. Oh, okay. Oh. She can't really do much off oh, of that. Oh, that was interesting. Uh, one thing about Sheik is, like, if, if your teammate grabs, he needs to throw, and you need to know how high they're going to go off of the throw because when you're in a grab, the strongest move she can do is, like, a down smash or a well, forward air. I think in that particular situation, because Fox held the other Fox at a higher platform, oh, yeah. I think she could have actually just ran up and up smash. Yeah, tip or up smash. That's possible. I, I wasn't even paying attention to that. That, that, that could have worked really well. That would have been cool, too. That would have been swag. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you don't see Tipper up smash as much in, in doubles with Sheik. Because uh, the only other stage you could really get it on is Yoshi's, and it's yeah. really specific. All right. No 3-0. Good job to Paul Chan and Spark. Let's see if they could carry their momentum into the next match. Where do you think that they're going to take them? Um, uh, so I'm assuming they won't let him go back to FD or Dreamland. Battlefield, they love Battlefield. Um, All right, it looks like we're going. To and I don't think they want to go to Yoshi's. So I think really what's left is Battlefield Pokemon for them. Um, All right, we're going to Battlefield. Both teams. They're they're. I think they're they're trying to if they two v one to two v one Spark. Because uh, Sheik is much easier to kill in, in general than Fox. And, you know, Mass Ice is charging a lot of up smash. I think that was the third this set. And that's it's a little weird. Yeah, that is weird. I don't really know why he would be doing that. Did any of them hit? No, not one. He's going for, like, hard reads. It's weird because uh, he doesn't really do that in singles. Uh, he might be nervous, you know. We're not on stream much, so... It's definitely a different environment. He has a whole crowd in front of him. It, it's more stressful for sure. Definitely plays a part, especially here at the Arcadian, uh, where no rank players are allowed to enter. So uh, many of these players actually have never really gotten to play on the stream ever. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Uh, and it looks like red team's up. So it looks like they've done something. They've adjusted their play. And now, oh, if Paul we get Chen this kill, getting this edge guard. Oh yeah, good he does. Roll. Good, good wow, play. so they're they're looking more dominant now. Something shifted. Uh, I'm curious as to what that is. I'm, I wonder if they talked about it or if they just have that feeling. Okay, he finally got the charge up smash. Good hold oh, by Ice Buds. Fox McCloud is not that. Good. Uh, and Falcon dies. So even trades, red team up by two stocks. Strong, healthy lead, but being doubles, anything can happen. Yep, only up by one stock now. Sparks is at that high percent. Easy up air for the kill. Oh, oh the shine spike. Oh, and the no, gimp follow that's up. It. That was. <gasps> okay, he's fine, he's fine. okay. <laughs> <laughs> we both thought the same thing. We both thought Spark has to eat. Oh, good Falcon combo. Stomping to uh, stop the Fox from Ooh, up smash. Ooh, dash up smash from Spark and the Falcon. Ooh, that was a good down air. It, it saved, or uh, the hit lag caused a lot of time for the Falcon to get back to the stage. Ooh, red team both off stage. Scrambling to get their footing back. And these nares coming out of Paul Chen. Uh, okay. Good reverse. Fair wow, 2v1. I don't know. This is, this this is, is hard. <laughs> I mean, this is Spark. Oh, oh, Paul Chen. Okay, if he can. Oh my gosh. It's. Oh, oh wow. wow. That was right. like the latest. So, I actually have no idea how a Falcon does a 2v1. Um, <laughs> I don't know how he plays it, but I know what he needs to do. He needs to kill this. He, he needs to kill the, the fox because that's the easier one to gimp right away. I, I would think that the Falcon try to run around and get the other team to hit them, hit each other. That's what yeah, I that's would be it. trying to do. All, All right. right. Wow. So game five. Um, wow. I think they'd probably, they're probably going to run it back. It's either this or Pokemon. I'm pretty sure of that. But um, I don't think they were doing too bad. They just need to adjust. All right. Well, oh, back to Pokemon. Pokemon Stadium. What do you think of this stage? Considering that Paul Chan and Spark actually won. Yeah, I think, honestly, this is probably... This is probably their, I mean, they think it's their best bet. I, I think Battlefield was probably better, but uh, if they think this is better and they're more comfortable with it, then that that obviously changes everything. 
Comfort is the most important part of when you're playing. That's true. Um, I actually well, didn't pay too much close attention, but how much did you think the transformations messed with the, uh, that game? The, uh, the game they lost? Yeah. Um, well, I know when the rock transformation was out, uh, the green team wasn't looking good. I think it came out, it came out one time at the end in the 2v1, but it might have come out again. And rock is always hard to deal with as Falcon. If you don't have room to space, uh, there's um, only that little both. part on the right. Oh, red team showing wow. clear dominance right yeah, now. Yeah, wow. They 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 adjusted hard since the first two games, and now they're they're ahead. They're. I'm very curious at the adjustments that they made. Uh, what what was the going through their mind? Yeah. What to do? And you know this is you know this is why there's a difference between a best of five and a best two out of three. If this is two out of three, it'd be an, it'd have been over by now. But uh, at the best of five, different results. Definitely happening. Edge guard. Oh, and the both. Falcon gets gimped. He went. Oh. Oh my God. Oh. Back air from oh. Cheek. That was good. That was a good gimp. That was clean edge guarding. The f <laughs> ooh. The Falcon went out and uh, I think tried to like up air or something his teammate and he got gimped because of it. So um, I think this, he's done that before this set. So he might want to worry about Sparks edge guarding because Sparks definitely a strong edge guarder. That's interesting. Oh, Spark is actually was being the aggressor there for a second. Yeah, she. I mean, in doubles, as long as it's only for like a little bit, she has no problem aggressing. If the fox can quickly come in and take that that mantle back for himself, I see no problem with the she being a little aggressive. Oh wow. my gosh, this is this, just this is destruction right now. Yeah, this is, I mean, I, I don't think this is going to happen personally, but who knows? Oh, no. Ooh, we get the Zelda. Not enough. Okay, so I wonder if he'll punish the lag of Zelda. No, no. He, he, the Fox is keeping him way yeah. too busy to this do anything. That's a good job by Paul Chen. The grab, is he going to? Oh, oh up yeah. tilt, fair, edge guard. Oh, yeah. Simple edge guard. All right, I need to wow. head out. I got to play. I'm about to be on street, so I'll see nice you guys in a second. Nice commentating. Nice commentating.